Um, there were 83,210 tests processed yesterday, which is a, another record number, a fantastic result, and really important at this time as, the, as we enjoy the benefits of last weekend and the opening up and the far busier streets and cafes. Um, really encouraging to see Victorians continuing to come forward to get tested at the onset of symptoms, and that's how we keep these COVID uh, safe uh, practices. This is how we keep ourselves safe over the weeks and months ahead. Out of those 83,000 tests, one of the 1,534 positive cases of coronavirus, of which 226 were in our regional um, settings. Um, we are seeing, uh, it's, it's been reasonably encouraging to see the 1,500 number. We've seen it now for a few days. Uh, it does feel like we're, uh, we're sort of at, the, kind of a, at a plateau at the moment. The plateau is higher than we'd like, but it is in line, in fact, slightly under the Burnett modeling at this point in time. Um, and, uh, but we are seeing an increasing trend of cases in regional communities. So the share of cases every day, 17% again today, of uh, cases in regional communities is increasing. And frankly, that's what we expect to see over the weeks ahead as we start to reduce restrictions and we start to move around more across our state. Uh, we now have 24,164 active cases um, in, of coronavirus in uh, Victoria at this point in time.